Hey, back. I'm back, yes, I'm back. I'm back in the house for the video for today. Or whatever, yeah. Now, you know from the past couple of videos, I had a few problems, didn't I? Yeah. Basically, Ubuntu based distros not wanting to play ball and the Nuvo drivers being up the spout. It is the Nuvo drivers that are causing the problem at the end of the day. I looked into it quite thoroughly, basically. So that's a bit of a bummer. And I don't I don't want to have to swap out the GTX 9 series I've got in here for an older 750 tyre just to get it to boot and run and install and then swap it out again. Why should I have to? It should be correct from the word go. There is nothing wrong whatsoever with the hardware. I've checked it once, twice, three, four times. Yes, lots and lots of times. No good. I no like him. So unfortunately, <clears throat> unless 1710 amazingly boots fine, I'll be moving away from the Bantu based distro for the time being anyway and using something else. And I have decided what I'm going to use after lots and lots of thought. Basically, it came down to a Gen 2 based distro or an Arch based distro. But it needs to do lots of stuff for me. So, basically, what I've gone to my conclusion, basically, is we're going to go with da, 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 Sabian. Yeah, I'm going Gen 2 based and see how we go. I'll give it a good while, just in case. The live image boots up fine. Although it did give the new votes uh, error. Didn't it? Waited a couple of seconds and it actually loaded the current NVIDIA driver. And bush bush, we was away. Now why can't Mr and Mrs Canonical sort that out, basically? Because, oh, well, the 970 that I've got here is a few years old now. Is it four years old, three years old from inception? I can't really remember. It's a couple of years old, but it does everything I need to do. I don't see why I should go, have to go out and buy a 1080 right, at 600 squids. Because that's the only improvement I'd get. Going to a 1050, a 1060, I wouldn't get no improvement. Not realistically, let's really be honest here. So I don't see no reason why I have to. You know? Yeah, I know, that's what I thought. So yeah, that's the route we're going to go. And I'll let you know by the end of the next week how we got on. Yeah. Oh, yes, I will. So yeah, I'm going to be a Sabion user. So I'll better join all the support team and everything. And what have you, better than I. Well... It'd be interesting though, wouldn't it? That'd be an experience, even if it doesn't go wrong. The only problem I had when running the live distribution was no sound. But I imagine once you install it and do all the updates, everything will be hunky of the door. Yeah, exactly. Anyway, that's a nice quick one for tonight, isn't it? Sneaky Linux out. I see you later. Bye-bye.